Near Los Angeles Wednesday, a morning training run turned tragic. It's uh, uh, a tragic event, very traumatic for all people involved. A wrong way driver plowed into a group of Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department recruits, injuring 25, five of them critically. The deputies at the front of the formation could see the vehicle coming and they were able to get out of the way. But the people from they were behind the ones in the front could not see what was in front of them. And that those are the ones who were not able to get out of the way and took their brunt of the impact. L.A. County Sheriff describing the horrific scene, which he called a mass casualty event, the likes of which he'd never seen in his career. But as soon as the accident happened, the chaos the, you know, that ensued, he said it looked like an airplane wreck. There were so many bodies scattered everywhere in different states of injury that it was uh, pretty traumatic for all individuals involved. The fire station, which was just almost only about 500 feet away from this tragic accident scene, uh, the deputies came and knocked on the door and requested their assistance. Now, as several recruits tend to likely life-altering injuries, officials are heralding the quick thinking that may have kept them alive. It's my understanding that the sheriff's department took the four most critical patients to the hospital immediately before the paramedic squads arrived, probably saving the lives of those uh, sheriff recruits. The 22-year-old driver was arrested at the scene and taken to a hospital where he tested sober on a sobriety test. The range of injuries we have, obviously, are, are head trauma. We have broken bones, we've had some loss of limb. And officials say they're lucky it wasn't worse. There was a light pole on the east side of the street and uh, the one thing that was relayed to me was thank God for that light pole because the vehicle ultimately hit it and stopped as opposed to uh, possibly hitting more recruits. Sheriff's Department leaders say recruit runs in this area near Los Angeles are common and have happened frequently since the department moved into the area in 1982. The unincorporated area of Whittier is very familiar with the recruits running on the roads. There's several routes that are taken. The cause and or motive are unknown. It's not clear if the recruits were targeted, but the California Highway Patrol is investigating what happened. Lord willing, they'll be able to recover all of them, even the one who is currently in the most critical state is St. Francis. And uh, But they're just going to have a long road to recovery. We are being told that Several uh, families of recruits who were most severely injured were actually airlifted to the hospitals to be with their loved ones. The sheriff told reporters today that several deputies had told him they heard that car accelerating shortly before it hit that crowd again. The California Highway Patrol is investigating whether or not this was, in fact, an accident. Sheriff Villanueva says his goal is to make sure all of those recruits involved can return to the academy and complete their training. Yeah, just awful. Newsies' James Packard reporting for us tonight from Los Angeles.